All right, the frame will be made out of these three pieces of two by two, and I have the initial cuts. So this is the way the three frame pieces will be positioned, and channels will be facing each other so that the glass will run between here and here, and this channel and this channel will be able to slide in and out. All right, time to clean up these channels. So now we're going to make the spacers that go between the panes of glass and I just have this scrap wood around here so I'm going to go ahead and make these spacers out of this. Alright now that I have this piece cut to length let's go ahead and do a test fit. Okay, that looks pretty good. Now I'm just going to glue in a little piece over here that uh, extends up this way about a quarter inch and this and on this side about a quarter inch so that it locks it into place. Time to make the uh, window locks for each spacer. Alright, since I'm going to make quite a few of these, I decided to go ahead and make a little template. All I did was stick my pieces in the way they're going to go, drove in some nails, cut the heads off, and then this way I can use this as a locator so I can get every single one of these the same without having to measure them. So they fit in just like that, and then I'm going to put glue in between the two as let it dry for a little while and come back and do another one. And like I said, since I'm going to do quite a few of these, I just decided to do this to save some time. All right, let's go ahead and make our first one. All right, I've got my spacers all cut out, so let's go ahead and uh, assemble this thing and see how everything fits. All right, so here's a dry test fit. And this is how these panels will be put together. This will actually be the top when it's assembled. These panes will just slide in. Spacer goes in between. This will slide in. And this top piece fits on just like that. All right, now that I have this thing sanded and blended in, we're gonna go ahead and take it apart, paint all the individual pieces, mount it on the stairs, and then put the glass back together. Here's all of our parts. We've got our glass here. These are 10 by 16 panels that I picked up from a uh, recycle store. This 2x4 is part of our mounting solution here to our landing. Here's the spacers, all painted up. Here's the frame. And then these two over here are also part of our mounting solution. Um, to go ahead and put that on the landing. So we're going to put these up today. And then we're also going to go ahead and clean these up and prep the material that's going to go between. Putting up our mounting solutions here. All right, let's put our frame up. So we have a glass panel here. We're just going to go ahead and put our cloth in here. Kind of center it. And then I'm just going to put one little bead of glue right in each corner here. Just to hold it in place.
going to place this other panel of glass on top and we're going to tip it up on a side and use a couple of objects to hold it up and we're going to center it and we're just going to go ahead and run a bead of glue right where the two panels meet right here and we're going to seal it now that we have all these panels glued up let's go ahead and install them Quick note here, I had to uh, go ahead and relieve the bottom side of the top piece um, so that the glass would fit in it. When I put the glue on, it raised each piece of glass up by just a little bit, which meant this top piece could not fit flat. So I went ahead and uh, used my router and routed out a nice section where the glass can fit in. This last step will be to uh, just go ahead and touch up all these screw heads just so that it blends in and they don't uh, look so ugly here. I think each one of these will probably take two or three coats before I'm done.